Dela Wright, my envies. Welcome. Just in again, you know, I've been following up on this gist to know what would happen um, when Kabiesi will retire back to the royal mansion and we just got another information. I don't know, this is quite disturbing though. Um, um, uh, the information is that um, uh, Ebony like cried and fell to the ground that it was the driver and the cousin um, who uh, held her. Sorry about that. I'm trying to put on uh, the car. I'm looking for the key because it's getting uh, quite hot here. That it was a driver who held Ebony. That Ebony cried fell on the ground. That Kabiesi came into the royal mansion and um, after knowing that Ebony was there at the gate waiting that uh, Kabiesi drove, drove past. Sorry. That Kabiesi drove past. That Yes, that he is aware that Ebony was at the gate waiting, that he's very much aware that Ebony um, is at the gate waiting. But Kabiesi um, drove, they slowed down already because he wanted to be sure that Ebony was there. They said he drove past and he went into the royal mansion. So what that means is that they didn't allow um, Ebony access to Kabiesi in the royal mansion. Meanwhile, Ebony had said that if um, Kabiesi does not attend to her that they were going to stay at that royal mansion together that uh, he she was not going to allow Kabiesi continued to treat her as if he did not go to marry her, that he is his wife, that he, she has got every reason to be with Kabiesi wherever Kabiesi goes to, that the marginalization is too much. For me, eh, I want to think that... Um, Anybody who is not ready to do um, with polygamy, she just let polygamy um, a alone. Yes, so just allow polygamy be. Because honestly, because honestly, polygamy can be a very painful experience if you don't have the heart. And if you have not prepared yourself to uh, be a part of a polygamous um, system. Um, for somebody like Ebony, I really was thinking that she prepared herself to be a part of um, that polygamous system. And I was really, really hoping that, you know, um, uh, she will understand. I was really, really hoping that, you know, uh, no matter what happened, the fact that uh, she agreed to be married as a last wife, um, she was comfortable with the situation. Now, what is driving Ebony? A lot of people would say is jealousy for Olori Naomi. And most times I do wonder again, on one sweep, you say you want Nami to be friends. On the other sweep, you keep doing things that makes her very upset, that reminds her that, look, you're still the same person. Nothing has changed in you. Because I want to believe that anybody who respects themselves the way Dr. Elizabeth respects um, herself will get, you know, um, um, uh, the help that, you know, will get what Dr. Elizabeth is getting. Dr. Elizabeth is so well respected in the palace. The only of Ife does not play with her and all of that. That's because Dr. Elizabeth has shown understanding. And again, it's important for people to know that these are all African kings. And no matter what, they will marry as many wives as they want and they will do as they please. Okay. And so this one, the worst part happens to be that he has somebody that he loves, Olori Naomi. Um, going by the trajectory of events, you will know that you see this thing between Oni of Ife and Olori Naomi. There is nobody in this world that has the capacity of breaking it. Oni of Ife will always love Olori Naomi regardless, and he will always go after this woman. And that is the one thing that I do think that a lot of these Oloris should get used to. Now, what is the essence of leaving Ile Ife in the afternoon you were in Osun State Governor's Lodge? This man was not happy, and you decided that you will go to the royal mansion. The royal mansion that you all know that he will never allow you enter because of Olori Naomi. Because he's not about to make Olori Naomi um, upset anymore. Because he's not about to do anything that will bring, you know, any kind of trouble to Olori Naomi. This man loves Naomi so much to even think that he would want anything that will bring issues between himself and Olori Naomi again. So what is the 
what is the meaning of this embarrassment that you know ebony is causing herself right now if this information is true do not forget that these are all alleged rumored and speculated information making the rounds on social media i do not live in the palace of the only of if and neither am i related to the monarch i'm just a blogger and i get an information i reenact it and i post letting you understand that whatever information you get on social media you want to take it with a pinch of salt so my question number one question is that what is the need for all of this embarrassment? Because this is really embarrassing, if you ask me. They said that Odin of Ife slowed down at the gate, and they greeted him, he waved his hand, he looked, and he saw that this woman was there. He drove inside. Now, driving inside, I was waiting to see if maybe he would drive inside and go and wait and call her and ask them to call her in. They said that from the time that he drove in up until um, the time that this woman was crying maybe the i am and uh, uh, he uh, called and asked her to leave that place that it was almost an hour that um, uh, the woman cried cried and fell on the floor that it was a driver and um, some other person that came to hold um, ebony so this is the situation of things i wanted to bring you this update so you know what's going on i'm going to bring you more updates tomorrow i appreciate you guys so much Dela. right good night